This is an interesting and challenging math puzzle for kids and as well as adults too. Solving this kind of puzzles can be a great way to teach essential skills such as logic, patterns and critical thinking in kids. Welcome to our math channel Math Bridges Fun with Math. And the puzzle is, you can see here there is a grid in which 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 boxes are there. In these 8 boxes, you have to arrange or you have to place the numbers 1 to 8 in such a way that no two consecutive numbers are next to each other or they should be placed horizontally or vertically or diagonally to each other. Means all the 1 to 8 numbers should be placed based on this rule. Let's see how to solve this puzzle. Let's see how to draw the grid for the given puzzle. I'll show you. First draw one small rectangular box just below this one more rectangular box in between the same size one rectangular box. You can count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 8 boxes we got in this grid. That means we have to arrange 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 these numbers into this grid as per the given condition. Let's have a trial how to go on with the puzzle. For example, if you write 1 here, 2, 3 here. This is wrong because if you see vertically it should not be placed diagonally. That means 2 and 3 are diagonal to each other. So this is wrong. It should not be placed as per the rule. Let's have one more trial. 1, 2, 3. This is also wrong. Because 2 and 3 are consecutive numbers which are adjacent to each other. So it will not work out. When you are doing this puzzle, it's better to use a pencil. If you are using with the pencil, you can erase and you can give trial and error method and you can get the solution. Or else, if you are writing like this 5, 6 and 7, this is also wrong. Because as per the rule, no two consecutive numbers should be side by side, adjacent. Or diagonally should not be placed. If we observe 6 and 7 are adjacent to each other. Consecutive numbers. Similarly 5 and 6 here. So this is also wrong. So you should not place the numbers in this manner. Now pause the video for a while. And you can try it on your own. And you can check the answer later. Keep trying. Let's see the solution for the given puzzle. 1. You can see 2. We are writing it over here down completely in this box 3 towards our left hand side 4 5 6 7 and 8 if you observe here no two consecutive numbers are diagonally to each other or vertical adjacent to each other we have arranged all 1 to 8 numbers in the given grid let's see solution 2 it is also in the same manner 1 and 2 will be same. Just we are interchanging the position of 3 and 4. In the previous one, we here we have written 3 and 4 towards the right hand side. Just we are interchanging here. 5, 6, 7 and 8. If you observe here also, no two consecutive numbers are diagonally to each other, vertical, adjacent or side by side. If you get any other solutions also, it's much better. Just it has to fulfill the given condition. Thank you for watching the videos and encouraging me all the while. Like, share and subscribe to our channel Math Bridges Fun with Math. Thank you everyone.